Michael, that's a very, very hard end point for you. Yeah, we'll take that 100%. It's not an easy place to come. We knew that before we started the game. Always is every time we come here. Um, and with how the game went, we'll definitely we'll settle for that point. We'll take that and we'll just, we'll just move from there. And coming into the game, preparation's not ideal, but John's already said that he didn't want that to be an excuse for you, the, the nine-hour journey, the broken coach. Yeah, it wasn't ideal, but we can't use those as, as excuses. We've just got to get on with it, do you know what I mean? Like, uh, we got here, you know, I'd say, in a, in a reasonable time to have a good rest. And um, We got our rest in last night. Uh, we ate good food and we just, we just get on with it. That's how we can't make up the excuse. And I think we've, we dug in and we, we, played, we played, played well enough to earn the point, so yeah, we're happy with that. What did you make of the performance? You obviously had to do quite a lot as a, as a defender, <coughs> both yourself and Ross Sykes. Terrific clearances, yours in particular, where you slid in on the follow-up, sort of mentally alert to kind of s sense the danger. Yeah, like, I mean, I think it's one of our better, better defensive performances in terms of being alert and uh, like getting rid of the danger as, as best as we can for, for a while, to be fair. Um, but yeah, as I said, it's not an easy, easy place to go and they, they make it very hard for us, they're very direct and we knew what to expect so we just had to make sure we were re uh, ready physically and mentally and I think we was. In terms of the football going the other way, it was a little bit frustrating that you couldn't get on the ball a, a bit more and create a few more chances? Yeah, it was a bit frustrating, I think we tried to but um, for whatever reason we couldn't actually pull some of the stuff off and we had to tr uh, try and adapt and I think we did. Um, it, wasn't, it wasn't particularly great and it wasn't the best that we played going forward but clean sheets are a great bonus for the team I think everyone's going to be happy with that um, like I said we just, we just take it and we move yeah, and anybody who travelled down to, to see it and the Stanley fans have made a long trip to, to come down and back you they'll have seen a never say die attitude which will stand you in good stead definitely and there was quite a few of them that came down to be fair I think that was, that was a good turnout considering how far the journey was so fair play to them for doing that and yeah, it was. I hope that was one for one for them, basically, like for, for, for making that journey coming down. Yeah, we did. We, we tried our hardest to make sure that we we didn't concede and we didn't in the end. It would have been nice to get the three points, but we'll take a point away from home at a place like this all day. And the goals conceded, column is, is something that maybe uh, has room for improvement. A clean sheet is that a good positive to build from? Oh, definitely. I, I think it's a bit unfair that that um, goals conceded a conceded one. I think we've played well for a lot of games this season. But we've just made. A like mistakes here and there and I think we've been punished a lot for it um, but um, it's like, like you said it's something to build on now uh, first clean sheet I don't know how, how many games but yeah something to, uh, to, to, uh, to try and build on for this this week and just take it forward there was a clean sheet that the whole team earned and a word for your goalkeeper as, as well he put in one of his best performances definitely he's, he's been brilliant since he's come back in uh, he's made quite a few saves in, in, in every game that he's played in and he's played a key role in, 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 in most games as well but yeah today in particular he was very good um, and he was he was brilliant in terms of communicating with us as well because it was quite an atmosphere here. like their fans were getting, getting on top of the referee and trying to get behind the team and we could hear him, he was trying to organise stuff. To be fair, I think most of the team were uh, a lot more vocal today and I think we needed to be and I think that's that's one of the main reasons why we got the clean sheet so fair play to everyone today. you played with Toby for a good amount of games now, are you sensing that he's improving, that he's mm -hmm. kicked on at another level now? I think he's at a great level for, for his age anyway, I think he's a fantastic keeper and he's got great attributes and I think he's, he's going to go to the top, I really do, if he, if he listens and he applies himself uh, well but yeah he's definitely showing improvement at, like as time has gone on. I think um, one of the good things about him is that <clears throat> he's not played um, every game since last season. He had a patch where he, where he hasn't played and he's, he's took it on the chin quite well and he's come back and he's responding brilliantly and he's, uh, he's playing his part definitely right now so fair play to him. You get to part the league for a, a while now after a, a good little unbeaten run now. FA Cup next up uh, against Port Vale. Is that something that you look forward to <coughs> kind of switching the attentions to the FA Cup? Yeah. Um, Love the FA Cup, um, obviously you want to try and do as well as you can, get as far as you can. It's great for the club if you can earn some money as well. Um, yeah, we've had a little unbeaten run in the league which is which is brilliant and you probably want to try and keep that going but this is another game of football to try and focus on doing the right things and and winning games of football so it doesn't make any difference in, in that sense but yeah, um, we'll look forward to the, the games coming up and we'll just try and keep keep the momentum going. Yeah, just finally, can you go on more than one front? It's a gruelling season, we've seen the shift you've had to, to put in today. Is it one of those things where you can go on more than one front? I think so, definitely. I think we're, we're a team still um, trying to improve and, and build on what we're, what, we're, what we're trying to achieve. I think we're not playing anywhere near as what we can do. 
at the moment and I think we can play a lot better and I think in time that will that will start to come uh, but there are good signs um, and hopefully in the next couple of weeks we'll start showing that and bring it back into the league and stop getting up there.